Hi everybody, welcome back to U-Tips for You. Today I'm going to show you how to get beautiful wavy hair with lots of volume without using any heat styling. That's right, no curling iron, no hot rollers, no blow dryer with a round brush. You're going to do this simply by putting your hair in a certain style and letting it air dry. Now, it's hard to tell but my hair is damp. Um, I'm going to dampen it a bit more so that I can show you properly how to do this style. Um, this works great with fresh washed hair because your hair is more malleable then, but if you don't have fresh washed hair, simply wetting your hair uh, and doing this method will suffice and you just have to let it dry and it's as easy as pie. Okay, so let's get started and I'm going to show you what you need. You just need about three or four bobby pins. I have one in my hair. Um, and you can use the large bobby pins or the small bobby pins and you need a comb or a brush. Okay, I have a comb. I'm going to give my hair a little bit more wetness on the outside because as I was waiting to film it, it started drying. But close to my scalp and everything is still damp, but I had it a lot damper. So we're going to make sure our hair is damp because that's how we're going to hold the curl. Now if you have limp or fine hair, and you um, have a hard time holding curl and you know this, you might want to use a product to give your hair more holding power. Something like um, a styling mousse or a styling gel a little bit. Put that on your hair first and then do this style. So what we're going to do is we're first going to comb the hair upside down. And when you do that, you're automatically giving your hair volume. So turn your hair upside down. Try to brush it up off the scalp so that it's all gathered to the top of your head. Now, smooth it out nice. Make sure you can get all the way through the bottom. And I'm not going to put my bangs in because that's not really, I'll style them separately. But this should work with anybody that has medium length hair, it's a long hair, gather it up like I have here, at the very top of the head, and come right side up, okay? So what we have now is a very high ponytail. I want you to grab the ponytail in your left hand like this, and then grab the longer end with your other hand, and you're going to begin twisting, okay? Just begin twisting and then come around with the twisted hair and you're going to make a, a little bun like this on the top of your head. Take your bobby pins, gather some of the hair and then pin it to the hair on your scalp. Remember when your hair is damp don't pull on your hair. Don't brush it vigorously. You want to be very careful when your hair is damp or wet because it's fragile. You can stretch it. You can break it. You always treat it with care. And then you're going to put, for me, I probably could get away with two bobby pins, but I'm going to put a third. If you use the smaller ones, you may need a few more. And just grab some of the bun and then some of the hair to the scalp and attach it, you know, to your scalp hair. And there you have it. That's all you're going to do. Now, all you have to do is just wait. Wait till your hair is dry. Now, if you just washed your hair and it's really wet, you might want to let it air dry a little and then you can do this if you're looking to have it done quicker. Uh, because it doesn't need a lot of wetness in order for this hairstyle to take. You know, you don't need saturated. Just damp enough that you can style it. So we'll check back. I'm going to wait probably about an hour or so and let my hair dry and then I'm going to show you the finished product, okay? So I will see you shortly. Well, my hair has been drying for quite a while, probably about an hour. I was out in the garden weeding, so hence the little, little scraggles that are coming out. So, let's take it out now, and we are going to see some beautiful wavy hair. Okay, so all you have to do is go into your hair, 
and pull out the bobby pins. Now be careful when you do take it out, you want to just unwrap it carefully. So you don't want to spoil the curl. And then just shake it out and gently separate it out with your fingers. Don't want to spoil the wave um, by brushing it. Just let it sit now. And sometimes the inner areas are still a bit damp because you know it's hard for the, for the air to get in when your hair is tightly wound like that. There you have great volume. You have wavy hair. You did not have to use any heat and you're good to go. So take your hands and just um, give it a little volume. If you like to use hairspray, this is a good time to put it on now to hold the curl. Uh, so that you keep it in place and it doesn't come out. Like I said, don't use a brush. Don't comb it out. Just unravel it. Use your fingers to separate your hair and then you can apply a little hairspray. Your hair will stay like this. It will stay like this until your next shampooing uh, when you wash it again and you want to style it again. So isn't that simple? And you don't need to use a curling iron and you don't need to use heat or styling and pulling on it with a, um, with a blow dryer with a round brush. You can have nice, wavy, free curls just by putting your hair out. And I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you'll give this really easy uh, hairstyle a try to avoid all of that heat styling that damages our hair that we do over and over again. You can avoid it by doing these no heat methods and they're a lot of fun, they're easy. Um, and your hair is ready to go as soon as you take it out. Please check out my other one on how to, have straightened, how to straighten your hair without heat. I think you'll find that one helpful too. And please subscribe because I have a lot more to come. And please visit me on my blog spot where I do a lot of writing. And I'm also on Facebook, so please like my page there. And follow me on Twitter so we can stay connected there as well. And I will see you soon. Bye-bye now.